this movement of Indigenous Peoples Day. We're not just bashing Christopher Columbus. We're not just doing this just to irritate people. We're doing this in a thoughtful and holistic manner to heal ourselves from all the atrocities that have occurred to us. We have to do this. We have to repeal Columbus Day. And that's not an affront to the Italian American community because we're not attacking the Italian American community. What we are saying is that we're done honoring a person who engaged in acts of genocide. And that's not what we do here in the state of Colorado. The pure strength and resilience of our people is a miracle. We shouldn't be here today, but we're still here. And we're strong people. We are proud people, and we deserve the best. We want to say, just like those mountains, you may mine those mountains, you may dynamite those mountains, you may burn everything and pick it, but those mountains will still be there in the end. That's my message. becomes a little complicated, you know, for me as a non-Indigenous person to be invited to create this mural. One might, you know, identify it as being appropriative in that I'm, um, as a non-Indigenous person, I'm using an in Indigenous imagery. Um, but as I said, you know, it's really kind of a reflection of my life over the past 29 years and the relationships that I have built with people. and. Um, that's what's being represented in this image, but it's really their story that they are telling and I'm getting to witness. Celebrating diversity, celebrating each other, celebrating the change to Indigenous Peoples Day! This has been a long time coming. But I'm so proud that Fort Lewis College is at the forefront in this. And we persuaded the city of Durango, didn't we? Thank you all for gathering in this spirit of togetherness.